I feel like first dates should be during the day. What y'all think? Sorry, y'all. I sound like I'm out of breath because I came, um, I came upstairs and I have packages with me. That's why I turned my camera on so I can open them. It's only a couple and it's house stuff, so I wanted to do it on camera and tell you guys about my nails. So don't be looking at my nails when I'm opening packages. We're gonna get these things changed. I shouldn't have left. Cause when I was looking at them, I was kind of like, mm, I don't know. This is not a cute design for me. Anyways, I'm gonna start with these long, bigger packages. This sounds like I have to put it together. But it says clear bath caddy, so I already know what this is. I got a new bath caddy for my bathtub that was newly painted. So I wanted to update the caddy in there. I hope this is cute. Uh-uh, I hope I do not have to put too much together. I hate putting things together. I already see that it doesn't have the handles, so I must have to put the handles on. Is this? even gonna fit hold on I need to go see if this is even gonna fit all right I'm back I had to go check if this was even gonna fit on my bathtub it looked kind of small but yeah so this is the new caddy it's just clear and then it has I don't even remember what the handles look like just a second so the handles are like stainless steel and it just looks like I have to screw these on I hate putting stuff together like where are the screws so this next one is from that was from amazon this one is from the citizenry the citizenry ouch i don't know exactly how to say it but see the citizenry um this is something that just popped up when i was looking at decor on instagram you know one of those companies so i hope it is exactly what i want so this is a throw pillow Ooh, it looks nice this is going to go on my bed because i wanted to add my bed's completely white and i wanted to add nudes so i got this pillow um this pillow was 275 so it better be good it looks nice though so far So it's just like a long nude. It looks white in the camera, but it's like a beige. So this will go on my bed. I'll show you guys that. This next box is from William Sonoma. Oh yeah, okay. Wait, William Sonoma? But it says West Elm. I don't know why the box says that. Are they together? I don't even know, but this is some books that I got to go on my nightstand. Um, it's a bunch of just random books. But um, yeah, so they had them online in like color schemes. And I got the one that was white and gray and I guess like kind of silver because in my room, you know, it's like white and silver and it's just random books. This says traveling to and from Chicago by air. I'll probably never look at this book, <laughs> but it's just like a nice book to stack up. And this one is weddings in Italy. This is, ooh, this is pretty. Like, you know, just pretty pictures. I'm not gonna have them open, but there's pretty stuff in here. Ooh. Just like florals, you know, wedding stuff. So this, I'm gonna stack this. Um, this one. Okay, so this one right here, it says outdoor sculptures in Baltimore, but I don't like that it's gold. I feel like that's not really gonna go. This can go somewhere in my place, but not, um, not on my bedside, I don't think. But this one right here can go. Ooh, this is just white and like a gray. So let me see. Ooh. Okay, so 
it'll be like this and I'll show you guys when I stack those up and then I have two boxes from CB2 Candle holder. Nice, really nice. This is gonna go in my room. And no candles. <laughs> I gotta get some of those um, candlesticks. I thought I got candlesticks though. So there's like a taller one and they go like this see but yeah those are gonna go in my room somewhere not really sure where they're going i just knew that it went with everything but that's everything that i came home to dang i just wish they i i don't i don't think i could last like no i just don't love them and i don't want to keep looking down and i'm just like who drew on my nails I don't know I can get on here to say that I'm about to head to lunch right now, but I have my phone, so I will vlog when I'm there. I just have this little dress set on. I don't even know where it's from, so I don't even know why I'm telling y'all. I just pulled my hair back into a braid and yeah, I'm about to go have some lunch and we're going to um, Hell's Kitchen. So I'll let you guys know how it is when I get back. lunch and I wanted to add it with my vlog that um, was at Caesars because that restaurant is at Caesars too we wanted to go that night that we went to go see Usher but um, it's like well for me it was I made the reservation a month in advance but um, my driver because I took an uber to go to Hell's Kitchen because they're redoing the valet in the front so you have to valet like super far walk through the casino it's a whole thing so i rather just take a um uber and they drop me off like right in front i still had a little walk but it wasn't as bad as if i drove my uber driver told me that um he was hearing that it's two months like you got to make your reservation like two months out if you're trying to go on the weekend but we just went on like a random today's wednesday and during the day because it was starting to get packed as we were leaving and we were leaving around like five so yeah it's probably pretty packed for um dinner but it's all the same menu so it doesn't really matter what time you guys go but um we liked it um i of course don't eat meat but i liked all their options on the vegan menu everyone else got meat and they loved it so um they even ordered stuff to go so that means it was good so yeah um yeah i would go back because there's some things that i didn't get i would probably try to get something different oh and i really liked my drink they made a really good drink i had a sidecar and it was perfect this vlog might be a little bit all over the place it's because i'm trying to keep all the stuff for my like i will I don't know if you guys can see right now it's still a little swollen but i wanted to keep all that stuff together but i'm gonna try and do my best with my editing skills and make it make sense so our reservation was for two and i'm like i'm sitting there thinking i'm like why why when you do like first dates why does it have to be like dinner like at night like everyone oh let's go to dinner let's go to dinner why we can't do lunch like i feel better like it's daytime you feel, oh well i guess i guess people work <laughs> i don't know but like i feel like a lunch date is like better to get to know it doesn't put like the pressure of like oh it's nighttime okay you know what i mean like 
I don't know. I was just thinking that. I was like, hmm, you know, I had my little drink during the day. I was like, this is good because then I can go home. You know, I still can get stuff done. And I don't know. I feel like first dates should be during the day. What y'all think? So I just got back from West Elm. I really want to show you guys what I got. But um, there's about to be someone coming upstairs. He's about to um, he's about to put new batteries in my um, motor shades because um, they're starting to move slow. And I got them done, I think, almost three years ago. Yeah, maybe almost three years ago now or coming up. And um, yeah, so or maybe two. I don't know. But I've never had the battery change. So. They're about to come do that and then after he leaves i will show you everything because i want to put some of this stuff in its place because i'm so excited like we are almost done in here so the guy who just changed the batteries in all of the shades in my place just left so i'm about to quickly go through everything that i got i'm gonna go through um z gallery first because it's such a little bag i barely got anything so i just randomly grabbed this feather pin like i just thought it would go with the decor by my front door because it's like black and gold and um yeah so i'm just gonna put that pin by the front um entryway and then i got two this book i don't know it's called eat pretty i just kind of liked and it says nutrition for beauty inside and out and I just thought it would be interesting. I don't know where I'm going to put it. It doesn't really go with any of the decor, but I don't know. It's just, you know, meals and stuff that like enhances like your beauty. So I just thought it was kind of interesting. So I grabbed that. And then this is a journal. It says a journal on joy. And mainly I got it because of the, you know, the um, cover because it goes with my room. So I'm just gonna put this in my room somewhere and I will use it because I do journal. Kind of weird that it doesn't have any lines, but whatever, it's really cute cover. So I grabbed that and that's everything that I got from Z Gallery. Honestly, I didn't see anything that I liked in Z Gallery at all. Um, in my house though, what I got, what I have from Z Gallery is my couch, my coffee table, and my bar cart. I feel like Z Gallery is a little like too glam for me right now. I don't know. Um, I also got this like a vase over there. Like I find things every now and then, but lately I just have not been like my style has just not been Z Gallery. So after Z Gallery, I went upstairs to Nordstrom and the only thing I found there was just a candle. And it's just, I mainly got it because of the outside of it is black and gold and it can either go by my front, um, like my front entryway or even on the bar cart because the pictures um, right here are black and gold. And it's called champagne. I mean, it's called crisp champagne. So I thought that would be good because like, you know, I have the champagne bottles and oh, it melted you guys. I'm taking this back. Look it. Oh my gosh. It was in my car all day. Do you think they're gonna blame me? Or should I take it back? I'm gonna try and take this back. Oh, it smells so good though. Oh, also I got at um, Nordstrom. I didn't, um, I had to order it. So I got the um, Tom Ford uh, FN Fabulous candle, like the black candle to go on my bookshelf. So they did not have that in stock, but I ordered that. And then, yeah, I got this candle. Okay, so I'm gonna have to go back and figure that out. I went to the container store and there's not much to show. I, oh, I forgot I got this. Okay. So I got this little, this is so heavy. I think this, it's like a marble. It was actually in the bathroom section, but I think I'm gonna put this like on my, um, one of like my shelves in my, bedroom because it goes like with the decor and you know I could just put something in there I don't know what I'm gonna put in there yet but I know I can find something and then I um 
so I went two days in a I went two days in a row to the container store and the first time I got I just got like containers and stuff for my freezer and then for my bathroom drawers um, and then I also got these hands-free um, soap dispensers I got I mainly the first day I went and got one for my guest bathroom and I got this white one but it's so cute and like modern so I went back and got this white one for my bathroom and then I also got the stainless steel to go in the kitchen because I feel like it will go with like this faucet in here to be stainless steel but the white ones look really good in the bathroom and I'm not going to show you guys all this container stuff it's basically just organization things for my bathroom and my freezer now today i went to west elm and i got a lot of stuff so ordered i had ordered um three pictures for my bedroom i went to get these big candles but they were all sold out i'm so sad they were sold out online too i have to figure out where to get them like i'm looking for like those bowl candles like those big it was like a big bowl and i was gonna put it on the books in my bedroom like on top of the books in there it was gonna look so good but yeah they're sold out so i'm gonna try and like google somewhere else but um that yeah so i ordered three pictures for my room um i got two to go above my bed and then one behind my door i got these candle holders i have three of these and they're all different sizes and then there's one a little shorter than this i don't know if these are going to go on my bar cart or in my bedroom on my other nightstand so i'm gonna just play around with them since I have three, I could maybe put two somewhere and then put one. I don't know. So I'm going to figure it out. And then I just got this little, it's just, what is it called? Glass knit. That's what it's called. And it's just like a little, you know, like a decorative piece. I kind of have one sort of like in my living room, but this one is going to go in my room on probably on some books somewhere or something. So... These are pillow inserts because I got two um, throw pillows for my bedroom and those weren't um, in stock in store, but they ordered it, them for me. So those will also be here next week. I got this tray. It looks kind of like loud because it's like super silver, but it looked cute on the bed that I saw. Um, I don't really eat in my bed too much. Um, I mean, I will like, you know, if it's like a snack or something and I'm in there, but I don't like do like full on meals, like maybe like, I don't know, a drink or something, but just how they had it set up on the bed. I'm thinking more for like, just the niceness of it, just the, how they had the flower and everything set up. I know it's like, I'm doing a lot, but I don't have a, a bench in front of my bed, but just how it had, was set up, I just liked it because the bed was the same colors that my bed was. So, I mean, that my bed is. Yeah, so I just got that tray. It wasn't that much either. It was, this was $45, but you know, it, it's, it's gonna look cute. These both are basically like rows for my bed, even though I have one already at the end of my bed. But this one matches the two uh, pillows that are coming and it's white and like beige. And it just, it just goes super cute. So right now I have like a knit one already and I'm gonna see how this works together. But if not, I grabbed another one because I seen how it was on the bed. Like it was the same colors as my bed, white and then tan. So I just went ahead and grabbed how they had it as well in case. But even if not, I can just have this extra blanket in my room. This is also for my bedroom. I grabbed coasters. I know, I'm like doing a lot. But um, I don't know if I'm gonna switch these out with, cause I have some right in my living room that are more like beige and tan, kind of uh, what my colors are in my bedroom. And then these are just white. They look exactly the same as the ones that I have in my living room right now. Just a little different color. I'm talking about the shape. Like they're just, like, so I got those for my room because when I have a glass in there, you know, I don't wanna mess up my, my dresses are already, my dresses are like already kind of like messed up from setting stuff on there and just, you know, not taking care of it. So I just grabbed those. I got this. 
oh this i saw it had like a little plant in there this i saw on the um the tray that i have the um silver tray and this was on there and it had like a little flower and it was just like the cutest setup on the bed so that's what i got this for but i can also put it on my you know, anywhere in my room, cause this matches, it's just, you know, white. Lastly, I have two of these big faces. Okay, and these are tall vases. And I got two because they're to go by the, um, both in both of my bathrooms, like on the side of the toilet, in the shower, in the guest bathroom, there's like a space right there. And I felt like I need to put like some sort of like plant in vase right there so i found these two i've been looking everywhere for a vase like this i kind of wanted it wider i'm gonna make it work because i don't know i want it to stand up high so i'll stuff it if i have to i'm good i'm just gonna make these two work so that's everything that i got this week for my place and mostly i wanted to finish my um i think i said this earlier in the video like basically every place i want to finish this place exactly. all right you guys oh my goodness okay so it's the black eye for me it's 9 p.m exactly 9 p.m and i am getting ready to go to dinner um i was putting on my oops i was putting on my makeup and i was like i should start filming a little bit oh I can't wait until I have everything clean in here, but I'm so glad I can sit down at my little makeup area. Yeah, I wasn't able to do that just a couple, actually just yesterday, I just started cleaning up. But anyways, I am getting ready to go to dinner. We're going at 10, which is kind of late. I mean, for like, I don't know. Like, it's not late because if I was going with my friends, like we could do late dinner, like what, nine, 10, it doesn't matter, 12, it doesn't matter. But like when I'm meeting up with like a dude I haven't seen in a long time, I feel like 10, I don't know. But whatever, I'm just gonna go and um, eat my food and then have some good conversation and come home. Cause that's gonna be that. <laughs> my makeup and face looks crazy right now, but I just highlighted first, so. Yeah, I think I'm gonna drive. I don't usually drive because like I wanna drink, but I'm not gonna drink like I can't drive home. And it's like very, very close to me where we're going. So I'm like, I'm down the street. A couple drinks ain't gonna really hurt me. It's not really like a dressed up place but i'm like on this new thing i'm like i need to show up dress wherever i go so i'm just gonna wear you know like i've gone to this place in like sneakers and like but it was super super late it was like really late it was after 10 like i met my girlfriends probably at like midnight um but i don't want to wear sneakers like no even though I'm like not like super, you know, into this person, like I don't wanna show up like, you know, some sneakers. My hair is in a ponytail, that's why my hair is wrapped because my hair, um, and then I just put a braid in it so it can um, kind of be like crinkly, put some body in it. I, um, you know, when your hair is starting to like get, like it needs to be washed, it's like straight, but it needs to be washed. So it's kind of, but the ends are still kind of cool. So that's why I'm just gonna put it in a ponytail. And we're gonna rock that, throw some hoops on, and call it a night. I feel like usually if this was like a date date, I don't know what a date date is. Well, like, you know, I don't know, maybe just with somebody else. I would probably put on like a dress or something, you know, like really. And it depends on where we're going to. And this place ain't like dress. Like if I wore a dress, actually, I, you know, honestly, like I said, I can wear whatever I want. Good morning. Oh my gosh, I need to charge my camera. I have a long day today. I don't think I'm gonna take my camera. I'll just do it on my phone because I'm gonna be running around. I have to finish, um, hold on. I'm going to text and tell them to bring my car to the front so I can leave. Okay, yeah, so, um, let me show you what I did yesterday. I'm so excited because I can sit down. I mean, it's still messy in here, but I definitely made progress. 
So all of this makeup is going in the trash. It's just old and oh, I heard something bad things like about this sunblock and this is like my go-to sunblock i've been using this for years but now they're saying like it's like cancerous and it's bad it's with the johnson and johnson or something i don't know so um i'm about to throw this away and all of my other ones because i used to buy them like three you know just so i have it so i switched over to beach something I don't know i'll let you guys know when i go in there but anyway so that is going in the trash as well i still need to go through all of my brushes i just feel like i have a bunch of brushes that i don't even use especially like the really cheap ones like i never use them but i buy them there's only one cheap brush that i like and that's the elf like flat top brush and i use that to like put on my um finishing powder i don't know i still really like it even though it breaks and i have to keep rebuying it i still like it but everything else i don't use i'm just trying to get rid of everything that i don't use and yes um there are some palettes and stuff that i don't use often some of these colors like this i only use like halloween i have to get some more plastic containers because this is going to be my finishing powder and highlighting drawer and as you can see I don't have everything in there. And then I, this is gonna be my lip drawer. I have lip glosses back there. Um, and I still got rid of, these are all the lips that I'm getting rid of. So old, I need like a little container for like my um, lip liners. And then here's gonna be my lipsticks and I still have to finish. Here is going to be my uh, primer and you know, finishing sprays. And then here is like my concealer um, foundation drawer. Nothing is done, but it started and it's in order and it looks way better than what it was because oh, it was crazy. Now, yeah, I'm just trying to focus on one part at a time, which is like this makeup area because I did sit down and get myself together here today and it was so nice. I want to get my desk area ready so I can sit down and edit my freaking videos. That's going to be next. So I kind of like got, I'm doing one side of the room, which is like where I was filming. And I need to figure out, I don't know why I save boxes, y'all. Like, it's ridiculous. I don't know what the heck. Like, why? I don't know. I'm going to, I'm, I'm going to get another one. Like, when I shop again, I get another box like... I'm going to get rid of all those. I'm just going to throw them away. Today, what I'm going to do is get some uh, plants to go in the little vases that I that you guys saw me buy the other day. So I want some plants, not plants, but you know, um, like flowers or whatever, like those tall things to go in there. Um, I want to get that. I'm going to Home Goods basically just to see what I can find and still kind of look for that as well, those uh, plant things. Once I get this room clean, I can see what I need for this room. But right now, I'm not going to even buy much because I don't want to have so much stuff. You know, unnecessary stuff when I already got to get rid of this stuff that's in here. Yeah, I'm really happy. I'm almost done. It just puts me in like a better mood to be able to just navigate through my place and it's just done you know instead of me having to be like oh i gotta buy this i gotta get that you know um what else oh i wanted to stop by uh lee's to get a couple bottles for my bar cart that i'm missing my bar cart's pretty much done for right now like it has everything that it needs and then the top shelf is that's gonna be like what I change like during the holidays and stuff. So pretty much right now it's just basic. I'm about to throw out this makeup. Okay, so these are the brushes and sponges that I'm keeping. These are the ones that I'm getting rid of because yeah gotta go back home i went everywhere except 
home goods because when i pulled up to home goods the line was literally like the line and i'm talking about the checkout line the checkout line was like basically outside like it was so crazy i don't know why it's monday it was like 2 p.m i don't know but it was looking too crazy and i'm like even if i find something i'm not gonna want to stand in that line like i would probably still be there and it's yeah it's almost four i'm pretty sure i would have still been there but um, instead of that, I just went to Home Depot. I got me this um, snake plant to go outside on my balcony because um, I threw away the old one because I just, I did not take care of it, you guys. It's so crazy though, because they're easy to take care of because you really don't have to water them that much. It's just, um, and then if it starts to die down and look ugly and then you put water in there, it like literally comes back to life. So, but my other one, I just did that too many times and it was just starting to look really crazy. So I got a new one and um, I got all of the fake um, stuff for the vases and I'll show you guys that in a second. I'm mad because there's like an alcohol sh shortage of like the good stuff because they said since the pandemic, it's not being made as um, often or as easily or something they were saying. So um, I needed to get um, more tequila. I have a fresh bottle of Azul, so that's fine. But like I needed like um, 1942, I needed more Casamigos. I have a like half empty one. I have a half empty one there, but I wanted like both light and dark, which is so crazy because when I'm usually in the store, I don't think to get like, you know, like I have a lot of stuff. So I never, when I saw it, like I didn't think like, oh, there's about to be a shortage. Like I didn't know when I saw it, I should have got it. It was just, I went in. This was a while back. I went in for what I was going for and then that was that and I just left. I went to three liquor stores too of the same ones that I usually go to in Summerlin and I might have to go to the hood or something like, I don't know. I wanted to get um, Deleon because when I went to the, um, out to eat yesterday, that was one of the tequilas. They give you like a fleet of tequilas to try and De Leon was one of them. And I've been saying I wanted to get that because I wanted a, um, like another black owned um, tequila on my um, cart. And I was saying that I wanted to get it before I even tried it. But now that I've tried it, I want I wanted it because it was good. So um, I just went ahead and got the Reposado and the um, the light because um it was i found these at total wine or something like that because at the first two liquor stores they were out they were out of de leon like are people really drinking well i guess they are i don't know i guess it's good because it is good light and reposado and i am gonna have to be stingy with my alcohol now that they talking about shortage y'all gonna have to drink that 1800 is something in the cabinet because my cart, I don't want it looking all run down because I want my cart to look nice and you know, it ain't to be knocking back bottles. Like you can get a taste, you can get a shot, you know? So, I'll get this one. Ooh, it don't fit. Ugh, something has to come out. We're behind here with the tequilas. I guess yeah so I need two more bottles of this and I want to do say on here and yeah anyway so this is what I got from Michaels I ended up getting a bunch of flowers for this thing over here well it's gonna be higher because I got more than one so Let's try it. I feel like I need one more of this green thing. I don't know why I didn't get three because when I was putting them together, like in my hands, I was holding them and it looked good with two, but how they're sitting in this um, little vase thing, like I feel like it needs like one more right in the back in the back in the middle. Now I'm going to go see how the one in my room is going to look. I might want to switch them out, but I don't know. I'm about to go see right now. And I just got these different little, I don't even know what these are, but eucalyptus and I don't know what those are, but we're about to go see how that looks.
so that's everything that I got from today and I'm going to do today. I think I'm going to close this vlog out because it's starting to get long and it's all over the place so when i get everything else that i ordered i'll just show you guys in a different vlog i'm about to head in this room and clean up a little bit before i have a little date later yes you girl got a date okay no i'm sweating but for real so um thank you guys so much for watching this video and i'll see you guys in the next one